Hello all. In this video, we'll see the concept of transmission impairment. So first of all, see first of all, we'll see what is mean by transmission impairment. So the signals travel through the transmission media, which is which are not perfect, and that signal is causes this uh, signal impairment. It means that the signal at the beginning of the medium is not same as the signal is not same. as the signal at the end of the medium uh, that is called as a transmission impairment impairment so there are three causes of impairment first one is attenuation second is distortion and third one is noise so one by one we will see all three causes of the transmission impairment so the first cause of transmission impairment is attenuation it means loss of energy means that signal is the weaker signal so the when that particular signal travels through the medium it loses the energy due to the overcome resistance of the medium it means that particular signal as original signal and that signal travel through the medium is not same so to overcome or to compensate this loss of energy we we use the amplifier and after the amplifying this signal that particular signal is sent to the and that uh, a destination channel or we can say the destination uh, node okay so in this figure if we observe that you uh, if you observe that the original signal is like this and through the when it travels through the transmission media it get attenuated means that particular signal is the weaker signal it changed from the origin original signal to the uh, attenuated signal the, through the transmission media so in between amplifier is used to compensate this loss of energy and will get the um, amplified signal so this is about the attenuation now next uh, in uh, next is what the how to measure the attenuation so the to measure the loss or gain of energy the unit required is a decibel unit and it is represented by like this db is equal to 10 log to the best 10 p2 divided by p1 and here p1 is the input signal and p2 is the output signal now next is a distortion so the distortion means that ch signal changes its form or it changes its shape so this distortion is occurs due to the composite signal so first of all what is mean by the composite signal so the composite signal is the combination of two or more simple sine waves with different frequency phase and amplitude so as we mentioned here that the uh, distortion occurs due to the composite signal so as we know that the frequency of every component has its own propagation speed when it travels through the medium then it has a different delays that different components therefore it arrive with the different delays at the receiver and the, it means that the particular signal have the different phases at the receiver they uh, than they did at the source so it, with the help of this diagram we will understand what is mean by this distortion now if you observe at the sender side a uh, composite signal is sent and these are the different phases of the uh, component uh, these are the different phases of the signal at the sender side so uh, when it receives at the receiver side it the shape or its forms is changes because because we know that every signal has the different propagation speed different delay and so it receive at different speed at the receiver side so at the receiver side there there is the different composite signal so this is about the distortion now next is noise so the noise means that is the random or unwanted signal and that signal mixes with the original signal then that signal is called as a noise so there are different types of noise first is a thermal noise thermal noise it means the random noise of electrons in the wire creates an extra signal second is induced noise so the from motors and the appliances and that device acts as a sending antenna and the transmission medium as a receiving antenna third noise is crosstalk so so this occur because of the effect of one wire on the other and the last one is the impulse that is we can call as the spikes that the signal with high wave with very high energy in a very short time and that result is from power lines and the li uh, power lines or the lightning etc so all these are the 
सो दिस इज द डायग्राम ऑफ द नॉइज दैट द सम रैंडम और अनवॉन्टेड नॉइज गेट एडेड विद द ओरिजिनल सिग्नल एंड इट रिसीव द रिसीवर गेट द नॉइज सिग्नल सो ऑल दीज आर द डिफरेंट ट्रांसमिशन ऑफ द ट्रांसमिशन इम्पैरमेंट थैंक यू